y'all it is monday it's almost 11 i've been up since 7 a.m doing all the stuff for the kid to go to school get him off at school make breakfast you know all that stuff then i went grocery shopping i went to target because today i am going to do my fall decor i'm gonna put up you know couple of my little fall pieces i don't do a lot but i do a little bit last week my sister and i went to home goods and tj maxx for some throw pillows and found these two i found this i was gonna do like a little orange here a little orange here you know with that and then this little orange throw but i want one more to go in that corner and then i'm still looking for a painting to go right here i can't find anything that i like and that's why this wall is still beer because I'm, I'm not gonna buy just anything i was in my basement focus i was just in my basement trying to pull out my fall decor storage box and when i tell you the, the something was buried from the bottom i'm the only one at home so may have to struggle to take it out finally got it out hauled it upstairs and i'm gonna kind of go through it to see what i have all right let's see what i have oh i didn't even take the tag all of these from last year i don't really want to use these anymore so i don't even know what i'm gonna do with them um I honestly, I'm gonna have to go to Hobby Lobby because that's all I got. I thought I had more stuff than that. One time out of ten, two times won't you be mine? We just can't pretend. This love thing can take time. Three times then I'm in. I heard through the grapevines, you missing a playtime, girl. Your beauty make them bow down I need that body right now Yeah mm -hmm. The love will never die down Together we can fly now So Baby don't you ever be afraid of fall in love with me Alright y'all yeah, So <laughs> oh god this is what i'm looking like i This is what my centerpiece is looking like for my table. Ooh, I just broke the thing off. I love these. These are from Hobby Lobby and these are $11.99 for one brun bunch, but they're 50% off. Costume. What about jacket? J-A-C-K-E-T. J-A-C. You forgot the C, right? Mm. Pumpkin is correct. I forget the R. <laughs> I forgot the R. It's a, I have to mark it wrong. No. I'm sorry. No. So you got this one wrong. Got this one wrong. I think 
party is fine. Well, no, no, no. It can't be fine. You did it put the R. So how can it be fine? It's they're gonna. It has to be marked wrong. But you did a good job because you're just practicing these words, and this is the first time. So high five. All right. <laughs> I have been a running mama today. I'm in my the office space. In here is a mess. I need to clean this up, but I was probably show you guys a montage of me cleaning up my kitchen, doing homework with the kiddo. My son question. Them fourth grade. Listen, my son is in the fourth grade, and somebody's mad. It hurt me. He has so much work. It's crazy. I was actually listening to the news, the radio the other day, more during the morning. And they were talking about the amount of work that the kids have. A couple of teachers actually called in and said that they don't give their students homework. No, my son gets homework every single night. Monday through Thursday, every night he gets homework. And then you guys know my son was out of school for last week for the entire week. So I reached out to the teacher and said, hey, since he's out, um, do you want to send me the work? And she was like, no, I'm not going to send you any work. When he comes back on Wednesday, I'm going to give him a packet of what he missed. And then I'll give him a week to finish it. <laughs> so I'm um, also every night on top of the homework that he has, he has to finish one or two of the paper because Wednesday is going to be the one week mark that he has to make sure everything is completed. And most of it is done yes man i will if i work the pitting them of me no know what if i work what if i stress when i look up in them but i'm just sitting here responding to a couple of comments on my video that i just put up so yeah i think that's it for tonight i was gonna edit this video and put it up but child <laughs> me no omega manage vlog over because me tired right now and i was about to go work out me just get lazy because i used to be on top of it i used to do my morning workout and then when i used to get off of work i used to either do a set of ab workouts or something but the laziness no so i mean if you stop with that i stop the eating dumpling and then something there mm -mm. then big flour dumpling no i'm not eating no more even the soup that i drank today i threw the dumplings away i just drank the soup and threw the dumpling out i mean i, I want a flour dumpling i think today and tomorrow's vlog has to be combined all right guys see you I am on my way to work. I have not worked in seven days. I need to take my braids out. But I made it through the workout, y'all. I made it through the workout. I will catch you guys when I get to the clinic. It's almost 11 o'clock and I have had three patients already with abdominal pain. Abdominal pain is one of the things that come into the emergency department. Someone asked me on one of my recent videos to make a list of what I see mostly in the urgent care. And I'm actually going to make that video. I think that's actually a good idea. Um, thanks. I don't remember who asked. Abdominal pain is one of those things that comes in all the time. And abdominal pain can be nothing or it can be something crazy. You can have a triple a going on right you can have std you can have appendicitis it's just a lot of gas constipation a lot of different things can be going on when you're complaining about abdominal pain i need some coffee i'm trying not to drink any coffee y'all but i need it hello 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 what's up y'all it's dark midnight out here um it's 8 30 p.m and i just drove out of the clinic 
47 patients later and a lot of tomfoolery today. I saw my last patient tonight at 7.50. 7.50, I saw my last patient. However, when one of the COVID tests completed, it was inconclusive. And I said this before, we have to sit and rerun the tests. So therefore, I had to, we had to sit and rerun the tests and the tests just got resulted. So we just left. So we left at 8.30, it's not bad. The tomfoolery, let me tell y'all something. <laughs> we should know, come in there because he want me to falsify his medical record. When I tell you, blatantly asked me to falsify his medical record. And when I told him, absolutely not. He was like, are you serious? I'm like, of course I'm serious. I'm not doing that. I was flabbergasted that this man had the nerve and the audacity. And then me alone in the room with him and me I go back and forth with him and he, he starts sit up like him, him, him start get vexed. So I just opened the door and kindly said, okay, I'm done <laughs> and walk away. Because at this point, I'm starting to feel, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna lie to you, some days I'm starting to feel, feel very unsafe. Like I'm, I'm feeling almost like people is up to a boiling point. If them start reach to a boiling point, my women feel like them are gonna just up and slap me or, or, or lick me on my face or something because people mad long crazy like that. So, so many times I'm just backing up at the door because me I said to myself, say, me and this person alone in this room, right? And me and you alone in this room together. And anything, you can't just get mad and slap me down and lick me down. No, sir. Me not like that. Me not like it none at all. Me never walk away from him. And then when I walk away from him, I just tell him, say, oh, listen, this was around 4 30 then time, the military eat it or nothing, you know. And I just tell him, say, listen, I'm, 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 I'm going to take a break. I'm going to take a break because this right here is just getting out of control. Mm -mm. No, sir. No, sir. Me no, me, me no know. But yeah. I eat that for today. Um, go home now. Go. What time now? I know my son is waiting for me because he does not go to bed, honey, until I step foot in the house. So I'm going to have to rush on in. Good morning. I didn't even show any of my routine stuff this morning <sighs> because it's the same thing. But I'm just gonna bring this grapefruit. I have some, um, this is a spaghetti that I had made. I try to pick out just the rest of the ground beef because I'm not gonna really, I'm gonna throw the noodles out. And then I blended up this kale, spinach, pineapple, mango, and ginger i'm gonna have some sweet potatoes with this that's gonna be what i'm gonna eat today at work what's up guys i'm almost done for the day it's 7 p.m i don't think i recorded anything today today was steady busy i did see 41 patients so far and it is 705 to be exact let's see what's gonna happen for this next hour lovely patients today everybody was so so nice today it was a makeup from the tragedy that was yesterday, but just want to check in because I realized I didn't check in all day with you guys. I will talk to you guys later. How about patient walked in at 7.45 for x-ray of the foot that was injured approximately two weeks ago. So it's now eight o'clock, x-ray is done. We have to send x-ray to the radiologist. It takes 30 minutes to come back. So I'm gonna be here until 8 30. Uh, <laughs> that's the joys of urgent care. It is now 8 35 and I just walk out on my way home now. And that's that for that. Today wasn't terrible though. I will say the patients today were way nicer. Way it was just a better day it was not as hectic as yesterday i did see 42 patients today but i didn't feel like i saw a lot of patients 
months which is which is good so i'm actually off for the next two days and i'm back on the weekend i think this is the end of this vlog i was trying to get this vlog out by tonight but that's not gonna happen because it is already eight almost 8 40 so by the time i go home shower chat a little with my kid you know it's just it doesn't make sense because i'm not gonna put up a video at 11 o'clock at night so i'm just not gonna do it so yeah this is not gonna go up until tomorrow that's why i said i don't know how this vlogtober situation is gonna be but i have a bunch of videos that i'm gonna pre-record and upload i know that's not really vlogtober but at least i'm putting out a video as often as i can that's how i'm looking at vlogtober put out a video as often as i can in the month of october so yeah um thank you guys so so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will definitely talk with you guys on the next one